Ladies and gentlemen, here we go again with another beautiful, gorgeous 2011 Ford Crown Victoria Police Interceptor with only 71,000 miles. This vehicle came out of uh, Coronado, California. It is a California unit, so it doesn't have no rust. Uh, for those of you that are not familiar with uh, the city of uh, Coronado, that's actually down south by San Diego. The vehicle has been completely serviced, doesn't need any repairs whatsoever. Does have a window tent, medium window tent, rear only from the department. Also, the car came to me black from the department. Um, I believe the department had this car painted and uh, they put it to work as a non mark unit. The paint does look really, really good, very shiny. Uh, I can hardly see any scratches on it. They, uh, they, I can tell that they did an outstanding job sending this car, this car for paint. Uh, it looks really, really good. No holes anywhere on the vehicle. Uh, those were covered by the paint shop when they had the car painted. Uh, folks, this is also a flex fuel unit, E85 OK. Uh, and just so you guys know, I do have a. Uh, scratches on the roof of the car possibly when they were removing the equipment or some sort uh, I'll point that out in a minute as I as I walk through around the vehicle here once again folks the vehicle has been completely serviced doesn't need any repairs whatsoever and it, it is in great mechanical condition and ready to go anywhere across the country Two good working spot lights. I do have clear lights and lenses on the front. They're very clean. They appear to be in semi new conditions. I do have a uh, set nut push bar or Satina push bar on the front. It gives the car a very aggressive look coming down the road. Everything works. And I do mean everything, literally. All right, let's go inside the car. Oh, actually, let me go on the roof real quick here. You probably won't be able to see see the scratch, or maybe you can. It's right there. You can see it right there. Right there. Aside from that, the car looks great in and out. As you can see, we do have a, a rear vinyl seat here. All seat belts and buckles are in place. Vinyl flooring. Door switches and locks are in place, so doors are fully functional from inside and out of the car. Electric. Uh, sitting here folks I, I have also had the uh, driver's seat uh, refoam refurbished so it's nice and comfortable now as you can see I do have an aftermarket center console there as well it goes well with the car I like that look passenger side seat is in great shape I don't think uh, anyone ever sat there no holes on the dash whatsoever Folks, as you can see, I do have an aftermarket head unit. Uh, this is a Pioneer head unit. Uh, let me clean this up a little bit here. This is a Pioneer head unit CD MP3 USB connection right here, auxiliary connection right there, uh, and it's also um, Bluetooth capable, so it's Bluetooth ready, hands free. Um, so your phone does work with the uh, with the stereo. All right, let's keep coming over here I also do have electric retractable pedals here and manual traction control switch on and off here okay spotlights do work let's fire her up I do have uh, two keys for this particular car two keys for this car no key fob meaning no alarm
All right, folks, 71,000 miles going on 72, lights off. We do have a uh, ticket light here, red LED, white LED. This is the new one, this is the, the smaller one, so it's kind of shaved to the car right here, to the headliner. Thumb lights to work. How it works. Let's go to the trunk real quick here. Folks, as you can see, I do have a uh, full matching uh, spare wheel and tire here. Let me clean this up a little bit. It's a new tire. I'm not sure if the wheel is new, but it's a new tire. As you can see, I do have the box for the aftermarket hitting it over there. And folks, once again, whoever had this car, they did an outstanding job keeping up with it. Uh, that Crown Victoria, it's for this particular car, is the manual for this particular car. And they even have a picture of that car there. Wow. Okay. So that and that will go with the car. Small cutout right here from uh, possible, possible equipment that was there before. Uh, okay, that's the trunk. And also, just so you guys know, the car has been registered. I do have the title, registration up to date, tax up to date. She doesn't need anything. Now let's go under the hood. Before I forget guys, uh, I do have drill slotted rotors all around here on this vehicle that you can kind of see them right there. Once again, drill slotted rotors all around. Brakes are about maybe 80%, so yeah, it does have a uh, stopping power. Alright folks, here we go. Once again, this is a California unit from the city of Coronado, California. Um, I do have the green silicone uh, fail-safe hoses. No rust. No rust whatsoever. Alright, uh, starting right to left here yeah, I think that looks good right to left I do have a new air filter throttle body was serviced and cleaned out I do have a new motorcraft landing spot plugs transmission service was done fluid and filter AC it's extremely cold so that that's really really good I didn't have to put hands on that vehicle did come to me with an Optima yellow top battery I do have a, a new drive belt and tensioner on this particular unit I believe that came from the department. This car is in excellent running conditions. And once again, she doesn't need anything whatsoever. She's road ready, what can I tell you? Okay, one last final look here. I'm going on my ninth minute. I hope I didn't forget anything. All right, here she is. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, if I could have your attention here for one more minute, uh, I would like to dedicate this uh, particular cell for my friends out in Houston. 
uh, everyone that that's over there suffering hurting that I don't know maybe I probably won't ever get a chance to know but I, I'm donating this particular cell t for the uh, to the Red Cross uh, whatever I sell this car for I'm gonna be donate donating six percent of that cell to the American Red Cross to help the people over there in Houston Texas that are going through it uh, and they're losing what they have and uh, for those of you guys men and women out there going to help Houston Texas from the surrounding cities or different states God bless you you guys are totally angels and God sees everything that you guys are doing and I do thank you for the bottom of my heart okay once again this cell is going to be dedicated and going towards the American Red Cross to help our friends out in Houston six percent will be donated to the American Red Cross for this particular cell thank you have a great evening oh I forgot this is the Crown Victoria guy signing off take care